everybody, this is Auto Tech Pro. Today we're in Sony 2021 Dodge Ram. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use the system and the feature that come with the system. Okay, let's start. Okay, this is some come with um, the newest version of the Android 11, and it also come with the 12 inches high definition screen. As you can see, it's very nice. All right, and this one also come the newest generation of the Qualcomm Snapdragon chipset. It's support the 4G LTE. What that means, um. In the previous uh, older version, that one usually support the Wi-Fi hotspot. However, this system come with the Qualcomm Snapdragon chipset. That means you can, if you have extra SIM card, you can also connect to the unit, and then you can access to the internet anywhere. You know, without connecting to the Wi-Fi. So that was a uh, very convenient, right? And this one also come with the wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. All right, so uh, the Android Auto is also wireless as well. You will fully come. This is also fully compatible with all the original feature, uh, like the tow hole, uh, exhaust brake, traction control, reverse camera, you know, steering wheel control. It will support all those features, all right? And the main point is it's also fully compatible with the temperature. As you can see, you can also, uh, when you pull up the manual right here, you can also change the temperature right here. If your car comes with the dual climate control, you can also turn on the dual climate control in your car if you come with your car, all right? However, this car doesn't come with the dual climate control, so you cannot change it. And uh, and as you can see, it also come with the, um, and uh, we the foster, front windshield, um, the poster and if your car come with the uh, heat steering wheel you can also turn on the feature from here if your car come with the heat seat then you can also come uh, turn it on this car does, doesn't come with that so uh, so you cannot use those feature um, okay let's start from the navigation first the navigation is offline you do not need to connect to any Wi-Fi to use the GPS at the beginning you will need to set up a little bit on the on the on, on the system have a nice trip you also come the voice control, the voice guidance. Have a nice trip. Drive carefully. All right. You can also select different voice. Okay. You can also select the um, um, the mile or kilometer. You know, and a uh, uh, little per uh, kilometer or the MPG. You know, and then you can also set up from here. If you can turn on the tow row from here. It's very nice, okay. So you can see, you can pick up the signal way right away. It's very nice, okay. And the screen is very bright, okay. And this one comes with, uh, come with the high definition screen as well, okay. I'm gonna show you how to use this GPS, okay. First of all, in order to use the navigation, you just need to click on the bottom white right corner right here and then the road and then address and you can enter the address right here. Um, the system navigation software also comes with the traffic update, as you can see, okay. However, in order to use the traffic update, you need to connect to the Wi Fi hotspot, all right. However, if you don't want to connect to the Wi Fi hotspot, you can still use the navigation as the offline regular navigation software all right so let's go get jump to another um feature okay um radio you also support the radio for sure okay yeah okay as you can see it's very nice all right so you can also um the bass is very good the sound quality the sound quality of this system is excellent, gorgeous, okay? It also comes with the DSP and equalizer, okay? I'm gonna show you one by one, all right? So as you can see, this one comes with the advanced level of the equalizer. You can adjust the sound quality based on your personal preference, all right? You swipe to the right, as you can see, you can change the, uh, the frequency over there. However, just keep that in mind, if you find that they have any issue, after you adjust the setting, remember to reset the setting back to default, okay? That's very important, all right? So I'm gonna show in a little bit so you guys can see clearly all right so okay so it's done and then you can just uh okay perfect and uh it's a little bit hot i'm gonna turn off turn low down the temperature right here all right okay other than that you know what this system also come with the um come with the different interface okay so this is one of the interface right here the newer version also come with another in just go to setting and then go to general and then you can see home page style you can also go here okay and then you can change the modern style and then the home page will be reset when you click on home and then see 
it brings you to a new interface right here okay so it's very nice some people they will prefer this uh, interface okay because it's uh, more like uh, Samsung tablet you know <laughs> so actually um, they also support the uh, Netflix Prime Video and Tubi Spotify you can download any of the application from the Google App Store we will also preload certain kind of app application for you okay so for example you can also go to the internet browser right here um, this one you can also browse the internet okay if you connect to the Wi-Fi you can see it's very nice all right this is like a big tablet okay it's very nice okay and other than that you can just go back and then they also come with a google map this google map is the newest version okay so that means it also come with the offline feature how to use the offline feature of the google map just need to click on the icon right here and then offline map and then select your own map and then you can download the map to the unit all right the system come with two configuration okay one is uh, four gigabyte plus 64 gigabyte okay the four gigabyte is the ram and 64 gigabyte is the storage memory you can also select the 8 gigabyte plus 128 gigabyte option okay from our website all right so basically once you download the map data to the unit and then you can use the google map as the offline map that means you don't need to connect to the wi-fi hotspot and then you can still use the google map all right okay that one is very nice all right and other than that you can also uh swipe up i'm okay swipe up and then you, there's a temperature right here okay and then another one is right here okay you can also watch the movie yes you can see um uh, you can also support the youtube uh tube spotify ways okay you can also download any of the application from the from the google app store right here all right okay so let's try some movie all right this is some also come the video in motion all right let's see the resolution superhuman bad guy has been compromised. We need help. As you can see it's very nice the resolution of the screen is gorgeous okay in a car you know of course this video emotion feature is only for the passenger on the road trip not for the driver driver better to pay attention on driving okay so another thing is i'm gonna show you go run some go for some um setting okay to show you what kind of setting that come with the car and also another thing that's really worth to mention is this is some also support the backup camera of the car even your car come with the alpine sound system and 360 degree camera this system is fully compatible all right so let's try it if your car comes with a backup sensor you will also be compatible since this car does not come with a backup sensor so you cannot use the uh, backup sensor in this car okay other than that you can also um, um uh, go to the setting way right here okay and then you can see um there's a lot of setting right here all right and I'm gonna show you the audio equalizer is right over there as uh, I just show you and sound gain is you can adjust the sound volume on every single feature all right and then video you can turn on the video in motion on this guy if you want to turn it off you can also turn it off from here all right so it's very nice and then you can set the default navigation software here from here if you want to use the google map as your default navigation software no problem you can also set up from here you can also change the boot up logo okay app customize you can also customize um uh, the different application okay depends on your personal preference all right and then start the uh, application automatically if some people they don't want any headache okay every time when you turn on the car you want to turn on the navigation automatically you can also set up from here right or maybe you can also turn on the spotify or whatever application you can also set up from here voice control is right here you will support the voice control okay and then system is right here setting guy okay that's a car model this is a, you don't need to change the setting right here this is also supposed to white right hand drive just keep that in mind white right hand drive all right so uh if your car come the alpine system you can also turn on the factory amplifier right here all right so it's very nice okay so you don't need to worry about this okay so it's very straightforward okay let's go to this car setting okay car setting is uh for the setting of the vehicle I'm gonna look for the setting first. Car setting is right here. Okay, okay. This is uh, this is the list of the system that will support all the uh the, the feature of the original vehicle. First of all, you can. Uh, that's too much. Okay, so I'm gonna. I'm not gonna go for every single option for you. Okay, 
Yeah, so you can see that it's very nice. It go through, it support most of the feature. Okay, many feature is right here. You can also control it. Okay, if your car come the accelerate mode, like right if you uh your car come the accelerate mode to control the uh, LED lights, okay, you can also control from here. You will also be fully compatible. Exhaust brake is right here. You can also adjust the original amplifier setting. If you want to adjust the bass, you can also adjust the bass from here. Okay, this setting, this setting are for the uh, original amplifier. All right, just keep that in mind. All right. Okay, so basically this is very nice. Okay, and uh, now I'm gonna switch to wireless Android Auto and wireless CarPlay. I'm gonna show you how to use the wireless Apple CarPlay first. Okay, uh, in order to use the wireless Apple CarPlay, you will need to um, connect to the Bluetooth first. Once you connect to the Bluetooth, then you the system will automatically switch to the Wi-Fi at the back one. So wireless Apple CarPlay, they actually use Wi-Fi. All right. So I'm gonna show you. First of all, you need to go to bring out the cell phone. Okay. After you bring out the cell phone, you need to search the um, Bluetooth of this system. Okay. So first of all, to uh, find out the device name of this Bluetooth. Okay. How to find out is go to here. You can see that. And then you got GT6-BT. Okay. And then, oh, I find it for my cell phone. Okay. Perfect. Once you connect to the unit, just wait a little bit for the first time. And then pair. Allow. And then you can see there's an icon and then it will automatically bring you to this menu okay it's automatic and then pay attention on the cell phone use car play and then you can just leave the phone on the side perfect this system also support the newest version of the ios uh, 16 that means it also support the newest version of the iPhone 14, okay? And uh, I also believe it will also support iPhone 15, okay, next year, all right? So um, in order to use the Apple CarPlay, you will um, just very easy. You can use the Apple CarPlay to make the phone call and also check the message, okay? The screen resolution actually is 2K. I just find out it's very nice, okay? It's not the 1080p screen. It's 2K screen right here, all right? So uh, actually, in order to make the phone call, you can also go through here, WhatsApp message right here. You can check the message over there, all right? And in order to um, click on the screen, uh, activate the um, Apple Cup, uh, the voice control of the Siri, then you can just click on the bottom left corner of this one. Bring me to the gas station. One option is ESO on Kennedy Road. Does that one sound good? What's the temperature today? What's the temperature today? The high today will be 8 degrees Celsius and the low will be negative 2 degrees Celsius. You see, it's very nice, okay? So basically, it's very nice. In order to go back, get back to the original menu, you can just, just click on the car, okay? And then it will bring you to the original menu, all right? This is very nice. Hi, hey, I want to show you. In order to uh, set up the uh, mobile from the SIM card, then you can go to pull down a little bit from the top and then you can see the menu right here. There's a setting icon right here. You can mobile data and SIM card. Okay, click on this one and then you can see that it will bring you to this menu, all right? So network and internet, all right? So you can see that and you can also set up the uh, SIM card, mobile plan, all those kind of features right here. Okay, this system can also be purchased from my website www.autotapro.com. If you guys have any question about the system, please contact us Autotapro. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.